Okay, Ticats uh, coming off a tough loss at Tim Hortons Field. Losing to the Rough Riders on Sunday. But come Thursday night, that field's going to be looking a whole lot different. Not covered in football players, but a bunch of yogis. Because uh, yoga in the field is back. Uh, so is Heather Gardner. And we have uh, two Ticat cheerleaders. We have Amber. Hello, Thank Amber. You. Good, Good to see you again. We have Sarah. Hello, Sarah. <laughs> uh, hello, you. Hello. How are you? I'm great. So back for another year. Back for another year. Yeah, this will be our second year doing okay. yoga Do on the field. we have to stand like cheerleaders like this? Do we have to be <laughs> yeah. Like well, and pop. Yeah. Do you still do the pop? Uh, pop, pop yeah, I still do the <laughs> pop. Um, so, so yeah, we're back for our second year of yoga on the field, yeah. celebrating the summer solstice, which is the longest day of daylight during, during yeah. the year. So that's happening technically to the 21st, but yeah. we're going to be doing yoga on Thursday, which is the 20th, yeah. and we're going to be doing some yoga right now. Okay, so who who, who can do it? Anybody? Anybody can do it, yeah. You, have to, so sign, you, have, to, you have to sign up, you just can't you show up? You just have to sign up, so head to the Ticats website, and right. people can sign up there and um, join us, and last year we had 80 folks, and this year we've already got just just over 100, oh, so wow. yeah, so yeah, like you said, imagine that, that entire field, but instead of footballers, we're going to be stretching our bodies. Well, you're... you're you're a former tie catch cheerleader. We talked about that yeah, last year. Yeah. What's, it, what's it like to be back on the fields and, and um, uh, taking people through your new, your new passion? Yeah, to be honest, I, I've spent many a season yeah, on that field. Yeah, yeah. And for for this event last year, even I was feeling kind of, you know, starstruck of the field well, and to be some down nostalgia there. there too, right? Being back on there. Oh, absolutely. Okay. Yeah, okay. it was really great. Um, yoga. I know we've worked through some things in the past. We have. Yeah. Um, I'm. I don't know. I, I appreciate it. I'm not. <laughs> I'm not. I'm not technically sound as, as you. I would be still be considered a beginner. Yeah. Maybe many people out there too. Sure. But, like, but it's you... good for everybody to move their bodies and to just stretch. And you know, it's 8:06 a.m. So yeah. maybe even the people at home can follow us it? along okay, for a little doing? stretch. What are we so doing? just come on up to the top of your mats. But anybody at home, just get off the couch or yeah. off the kitchen table. Off the kitchen table. They were sitting yeah. on the kitchen table. Inhale, reach your arms overhead. Exhale, into your forward fold. So reach down for your toes, nice long stretch, and then just slide up your shins to a flat back. Try and find some length here from the top of your head down towards your tailbone, and then come back down with your hands. We're gonna step back on our left foot and bring your left knee down towards the ground, and then inhale your arms up overhead. You can do that while you're taking a deep breath in, finding a nice stretch through your back, opening up through your chest. Bring your left hand to the ground and stretch your right arm up towards the ceiling. Look up towards your right hand if you can. And again, take a nice big breath there. Now we're gonna bring our right hand down to the inside of our big toe of that right foot. Come onto your left foot and then open yourself up into triangle. Now, because our right hand's already ground Ooh, down. Yeah, feel that, baby. Yeah, feel you that feel one. that stretch through your hamstring. Yeah. And of course, not everybody's gonna have the hamstring flexibility oh, nope. of our, our <laughs> cheer and dance team, but we can all try. And then on your next big breath in, come on up to stand. Take your time here, bend through your right knee. And we're just gonna move with our breath and warrior too. So inhale up and just exhale down. Breathing is key. I'm not breathing. Breathe. Yeah, so well, yeah, breathe in I'm yoga I'm holding and my breath in life. This entire time. <laughs> and in life. <laughs> inhale up, exhale down. We'll do that one more time. And then just bring your hands down to the ground. Step your left foot forwards. Come into our chair pose. Slide those shoulders away from your ears. Weight is heavy on your heels, light through your toes. And then come on up to stance. <laughs> We're getting applause in the studio. <laughs> well, th those are things I do. Normally, I'm like downward dog and doing, but there's so many complex moves that you can oh, go yeah, through. Oh, yeah, But, but again, things. you talk it through for beginners like myself. Yes, Anybody yes. Can do so it. yoga on the field, it yeah. is for beginners. It's for all levels. It's for all bodies. So we really hope that people will come out and join us. Have to have your own mats. Bring do your own mat. Do bring your own mat. Um, the first pom -poms, one. Pom-poms. You need your own pom-poms? <laughs> you can bring your own pom-poms, too, OK? <laughs> if you've got them. If, if, if you've got them. But yeah. uh, where do we go? We go to the Ticats website? Yep, head to the Ticats okay. website. Um, the first 100 people are going Going to receive a little special gift from uh, Nature's uh, Sunshine. So awesome. hopefully, people will join us. Have a great time, Sarah, Amber, Heather. Thank great, you. great seeing you.